السلام عليكم ورحمة الله This is Hany Ismail from Planning Engineer website I received a very interesting question asking yeah, Hany I have uh, 100 villa all the same type and I want to do a time schedule Should I uh, do one villa only or I will do all the 100 villa each villa separate schedule and this is very interesting question because if you did one villa only okay and you make the breakdown for one villa only you will not be able to monitor the progress because you cannot say i finish this percentage or the plant percentage and the actual percentage in the other hand if you did the 100 villa all together in i mean separate uh, schedule for each villa you will end up with a huge uh, time schedule and it will be very difficult to uh, update and even do the cost loading resource loading and the scheduling so the answer of this question in my opinion you should do it in phases what I mean by phases you sit with your project team project uh, manager or construction manager and agree about what will be the phase one or stage one definitely you will not work in the 100 villa all of them at the same time let's say you will work to 20 villa by 20 villa or 50 villa by 50 villa or 15 villa by 15 villa whatever even if you have different types make uh, a separate stage and in this separate stage, let's say you have 25 villas in this stage, you will add one schedule as it is one villa, but you will, you will multiply the quantities, the manpower, uh, resources, everything by 25. So if you finished, let's say, the footing for one of 25, you will update your percentage one out of 25. Here you will have another challenge because in that case you don't uh, or you cannot put the traditional relationships like you cannot put you have to finish all the plain concrete in order to start the reinforced concrete for example because you will finish the plain concrete let's say in 10 villas then you will start the uh, uh, remaining 10 villas plain concrete and in the first 10 villa, you will do the reinforced concrete. In that case, you have one of two options. To make smaller areas, if it, even if it is in the area one, you can divide it into stage one and stage two. And in that case, you can put the 10 villas under stage one and the other 10 villas under stage two, all in the same zone or in the same area. The other option is to make some overlapping between the activities. You have to make overlapping between the plain concrete, reinforcing concrete. You will have to make some overlapping between uh, masonry, block work, and plaster. You have to make uh, concrete work and rough finishes like this. And actually, I talked about this concept in detail in my uh, professional planning engineer course, where when it comes to the uh, mega projects or the huge projects, you need first to think how the project will be executed because before doing the planning itself, you need to think a little bit about the expected scenario. This will help you a lot in having a realistic time schedule. I hope this video was useful to you. See you in the next one.